Hey guys, it's Nelson with Galaxy Note 2 Soft Monitor, and today I'm going to show you how to protect your photos and videos and hide them from anyone snooping around on your phone. So, uh, the application that I'm going to review is called, well, well I already have it down, it's called Gallery Plus. Uh, you can find it for free on the Play Store. I've already downloaded it, so I'm going to just tap it. Um, it's asking me to draw my pattern to unlock. Uh, you'll be prompted uh, with with doing that when you first install the application and then you'll be asked uh, to answer a security question in case you forget this so I'm just gonna enter mine I just put a simple one from there you'll be taken to the stock gallery this will show all of your photographs that are on your device uh, then you uh, from there you can just start hiding uh, you can hide entire um, entire folders just by holding on it, you can select all of them if you want, or deselect them. So if you want to just send, I'll just want to send my Snapchat folder. Do that, then I press the I up here with uh, X through it, and it says one album had been hide. <laughs> um, uh, then you can go to hidden gallery, and there you can see that the album that I uh, just hit is now hidden. So you cannot see it from the stock. Yeah, uh, from your stock gallery on your device. If you go back to your photo for your, to your photos, um, if you want to just do individual photographs, whoops. Whoa! If you want to, yeah, okay. Like I said, if you want to just do individual photographs, uh, you can just go to the camera, then select photo, and do the same thing. Press always press the eye up there, and it'll it'll be uh, in your hidden gallery, and it'll come up in a folder. So, uh, other f uh, let me, um, you can also, if you can, uh, you can go to your gallery, and from there you can actually hide a photograph too. So all you have to do is share it to Gallery Plus, and your photo uh, is gone from there, and it'll be in Gallery Plus hidden, which is a pretty cool feature, and that makes it really easy to hide. So here it is. Um, some of the settings that you can change go to app settings you can change the storage um, the slideshow stuff there's a slideshow I don't really know why you would use that I don't know maybe someone has a use for it uh, security here's some of the cool things um, here you can put invisible mode so if you turn this on when you enter the uh, the lock pattern it won't appear so that way if someone's snooping or trying to see you they won't be able to see it um, now the other one that's cool is the hide uh, icon app and you can see that here at the bottom so if I turn that on it'll prompt me with this which will say call this number to open application so now if you exit the application and try to open it oh it doesn't open so what you have to do is go to the phone and now One, two, three. And if you call that number, that's a stock number that you have to call. You can change that to whatever you want. So if I call that, it automatically takes me to the application. And there I can get in. And just like that. Um, other few things in the settings, you can back up and restore directly to Dropbox. And the final thing is changing the theme, which is just change the color of the outside to orange or whatever color you want. All right, and that's it. All right, thanks, guys. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and check out the full tutorial over at Galaxy Note 2 Soft Modder. All right, thanks.